Well, good morning everybody. Here it is, Saturday, the 2nd of December. I thought I'd give you a little bit of a lie-in before we pick up with our tile number two today. So, where do we start then? Okay, um, number one we did yesterday, of course, and I've ticked it off. We're all ready to go. So, that could go to one side, ready? Number two, what have I done then? Here we go. Uh, written my name, the date, and what tile number it is. Remember yesterday we said that this was always going to be at the top. So what I want to do is turn it round and make sure that I remember that it's the top, okay? You don't have to, it's just so you can sort of see where that goes. And then from here, I can put myself a little line down. Again, it's just nice to get things in proportion, isn't it? And, and know sort of where they're going to go because they're not really going to be anything at the minute. As we don't know. So I move that out of the way and there we go. There's my little tile all ready to go. Now it doesn't matter whether you use a tiny, whether you use a piece of cardstock that you've um, measured to, to be the right size, the size you want, or you use uh, regulars or macros, doesn't matter. The whole point of it is try and keep up if you can and do one a day. So, okay, are we ready? Here we go. So we've got a little bit of a, a kind of a, a it is definitely a circle, I must admit, here. So I'm going to mark it in. And I think I'm going to probably leave this bit in pencil because when I come to doing the rest of it later, I'm going to be able to draw that in in one go. Um, just because I know that this is getting sort of, sort of central, isn't it? So we, we want that bit to be, I want it to be round. So, okay, there's that section in there okay next little bit then let's have a look i'm going to come in and let's have what we've got um oh dear this is going to be let's think about this for a moment i'm in the center bit here and i've got sort of um a line there and then um, a line here okay and then a line coming up here maybe a bit bigger than that you see and then a line coming yeah although this looks a little bit wide for this now so let's bring that in a little bit see the beauty of having a pencil okay so this is going to be it's, it's definitely not circular is it it's uh, quite a different shape there okay so, uh, see that? Yeah, that looks about okay. I'll go with it. And again, I might actually leave this bit in pencil because it's going to be part of something else and uh, we can always make different changes afterwards. So, okay. So, imagine, I don't know, maybe the, the middle's sort of about here somewhere. And what we've got to do is bring these lines in to that centrepiece. Okay, and then there's going to be one coming off here. Yeah, might come in a little bit more there as well. Let's have a look at that. There you go. Put that line back in for a moment. Oh, intriguing. Okay, so coming further out, I'm going to follow this shape, but it's going to come sort of up here. Like this. So then that one is sort of there. See, so uh, quite a wider bit going around there. So that fills most of the piece in. And then I'm going to extend that line just to help me, I think. Okay, a bit different. See, this one looks a little bit odd now, doesn't it? Because that's our centerpiece. If I just lighten that off a little bit. Okay. So here we go. Um, let's mark a little line in the middle of each of these, like so. And then here, I'm going to put like a little leafy kind of shape in, like that. And one there. Okay, that looks all right to me so far. And then let's have a look at this little bit here. Again, I'm going to mark in the middle so I'm sort of splitting that space up a little bit. 
Um, what do I want to do? I want to come in with, let's have a look. It's going sort of across here, like that. And then across here, like that. And then across here, like that. So that one's going to go that way. Okay. And then, let's have a look. I'm just going to turn it around slightly. And then I'm going to go from this point here, down here. Okay. And then down here. Down here. I'm going to keep all of this in pencil. So we can make changes if we need to a little later on. So I don't want you to worry about this in the slightest. Okay, straightforward. So that's that little bit there. And inside here, little loops. And then see, I've started in the middle and I've gone outwards. In the middle, and gone outwards. In the middle, outwards. All in those little shapes there. So you're going to get a little bit of one there. So far, so good. And in the middle here, let's put some little shapes in. Okay. And in there as well. And a little one there. And I know in here there's going to be sort of a little shape there as well. I'll share that. Yeah, we'll see how that goes. I say I'm going to keep all of that in pencil. All right. You see where we've got these little marks here too. Let's put a little. I'm going to go across there, across there, and across there. Let's rub out some of these marks we don't need now, so you can see what it looks like, sort of. So you're going to get part of that one, part of that one. And yeah. Not that one there. All right, a bit of a thinker this one is today, isn't it? See, when I draw my picture, I don't sort of think this is going to be straightforward or not. It's more about, you know, the whole thing. So there we go with that little bit there. And then looking at this space here, see where we put this line in? We put in this little line. See, I'm going to sort of put like a little shape in between them. Like so. <coughs> yeah. Oh, excuse me. Same here. So there's going to be one sort of wandering off over there. There you go. Alright, so there's that bit. And at this top bit here, let's have a look. It's, um, it's kind of got a bit of a curve going in here. Like so. Oh, Lynn. Oh, I hope she's okay. Sorry that my dogs have been made a bit of a noise. Another line there. I have no idea what that is. And then that goes across there. I've got one coming in here. And then there's like a little line going over there. And then these are forming little loops. Like so. And then you've got like a little shape in the middle of each of those as well. And a little dot. Okay, so I'm not going to do any more on that today. I'm not going to shade this one particularly. And I'm not going to put all this in pen because we know, oh, I've right, got some balls here. <coughs> oh, excuse me. That when we actually get to um, doing the other pieces that go with this, we might want to make a few little amendments. And that's absolutely fine. It doesn't mean that because we do a tile a day, it's got to fit or it's not got to. And of course, we could put this in pen and make the rest of it fit. But this is definitely going to be some sort of center point. Because if we look at where number two is, see here it is. It's in this 
middle bit here. So I wouldn't want you to do it in pen and then find, oh, I wish I'd have done this or not done that. So I'm not going to do anything else with that. I'm going to remember that this is the top, of course. See, I've still got my T. If I turn it round, it's still at the top, so we know where it's going to be. But for now, I'm not going to add any more to that, okay? It's, um, I think it's just worth remembering that we want this to be a nice piece don't we so we can always come back and put it in pen later so there you go tile number two for the day we will come back on this and um, make sure that you know it's all put in pen at a later date when we get to maybe a few of the others maybe even at the end because if we look center point look number 24 is here so maybe that's going to be sort of the last thing we do but that's okay so all right then everybody have a lovely day uh, take care everybody especially your uh, you lynn with your little pooch there i hope she's okay and i'll catch you at some point tomorrow okay take care everybody bye